traders welcome back to another video here at forex live hope you all are doing good and having a pleasant sunday today we will be focusing on a scalping strategy in order for you to grow your small accounts so if you have a 10 dollar account 15 dollar account and you want to grow that account this is the strategy for you if this is your first time on this channel please go ahead and like this video subscribe Turn on your notification bell so you can get notified when I do post a new video. And do yourself a favor, click the link in the description below and join my free Telegram group. Be a part of the Forex Life community. Um, if you are a subscriber, you're already welcome back. Today we're going to be looking at this amazing strategy to help all of you guys. Remember, the goal for the month is to get the subscribers up to 10,000 on YouTube. You want to reach a 10,000 mark here on this platform so all you need to do is share the video subscribe and like the video the more you share the video the better youtube picks up the algorithm and kicks it out to traders that on the same path as you that's also struggling with a trading career and that is looking for ways to make money but let's get into it guys i'm going to show you how the strategy works very easy strategy three indicators i uh, always try and keep it simple for you guys so there's not a lot of confirmations that you need i'm <clears throat> sorry in order to take the trade okay and this strategy works on all boom and crash pairs all boom and crash pairs and remember we are scalping so we're not catching the spikes we're catching these small little ticks these small candles so first thing that we're going to be looking at is the zoom level so this is the lowest zoom level all you're going to do up do is you're going to zoom out one two okay the second zoom level i'll do that again so one two that is the zoom level that you'll be using for the strategy so i'm going to explain to you guys how the strategy actually works so we can see over here that we have a buy zone we have a buy zone and we have a sell zone these are the levels for the buy zone and for the sell zone what we are waiting for we are waiting for our bollinger band to get into this level into the buy zone on crash because remember on crash we will be buying we won't be selling so we wait for the bollinger band to get into this buy zone and once it's in that buy zone we wait for our ticks our small little green candles to cross above the bollinger band okay once it crosses above the bollinger band you will then go in and you can scalp anywhere from 10 to 15 candles okay 10 to 15 candles so i'm just going to see if we've entered over here and 10 candles 10 candles 15 candles you can even go all the way up to 20 candles but of course always manage your risk so a quick in and out 10 candles out say stick at 10 candles scalp your way through and grow that account of yours so if we look at another example we can see we are in the buy zone and the candles crossed above the bollinger band what do we do we then go ahead and take our buy 10 candles and we are out of the market okay scalp your way grow your account risk management always apply proper risk management so if you do get caught by a spike you close the trade okay you don't hold it you close your stop loss is one spike over here again buy in our buy zone that's what we're looking for we cross above and we take our 10 candles let's have a look over here again we are in our buy zone confirmation one confirmation two we cross above the bollinger bands over here we take our 10 candles and we are out of the market very very easy strategy to follow guys confirmation one we're in our buy zone confirmation two we cross above and we get knocked out our stop loss get hit we close our trade over here it's not a big loss because we entered the market somewhere here it's not a big loss that we are taking if we've entered here we got caught by the spike one spike 
is a decent stop loss okay let's have a look here's another example we are in our buy zone we cross above we take our 10 candles and we are out so we have more wins than losses with the strategy let's have a look at boom 1000 okay on boom 1000 we will be looking for sell opportunities so what we will be looking for is the bollinger band to be in our sell zone those are our levels we are in the sell zone over there we we'll wait for the candle to cross below this bollinger bands we take our 10 candles and we are out remember we are selling on boom over here we're in the sell zone we cross 10 candles and out if we got caught by that spike we are out of the trade another one confirmation one we're in our sell zone confirmation two the candles cross below the bollinger band we take our 10 candles and we are out of the market we have another opportunity over here and we take our 10 candles and we are out this is a very very easy scalping strategy guys you can see there's lots of opportunities in the market throughout the day let's have a look at boom 500 there was just a sell opportunity now on boom 500 to take your 10 candles and you are out remember the confirmations that you need confirmation one your ball in your bands needs to be in your sell zone confirmation two the candles cross below the Bollinger Band. You take your 10 candles and you are out of the market. Let's have a look. Here we had another sell opportunity. 10 candles out. Over here again. 10 candles out. Over here another opportunity. So just endless opportunities throughout the day. Let's check boom 300. Let's just wait. Okay, there we go. So boom 300. We're in our sell zone. We cross below the Bollinger Band. We take 10 candles and we are out. We are in our sell zone. We cross below the Bollinger Band. 10 candles out same over here over here we have gotten caught by the spike we have gotten caught and we hit our stop loss crash 500 remember we are buying on crash 500 so we want to be in the buy zone we want the candles to cross above the bollinger band 10 candles and we are out let's check Here's another opportunity. 10 candles out. Buy zone, cross above, buy 10 candles out. So I think you guys catch the drift of how the strategy works. Really, really easy to do. I will be a bit more cautious on the boom 300 and crash 300 pace because it doesn't tend to go in a long trend at a time. So maybe I would cut it down and I would say take five candles, five candles at a time on the 300 pairs. On the 300 pairs you take five candles at a time. If you want to risk it, you can risk it. Remember, keep your stop loss at one spike. Okay, we're going to get into, we're going to go ahead and get into the settings of the strategy. So I see this three indicators that you'll need for the strategy you go ahead and you click on the indicators tab on your main chart you go ahead and click on the f plus and you're going to click on bollinger band these are the parameters that you would need for the bollinger band period 20 deviation 0 0.500 shift 0 apply to close and you can choose any color of your choice i just chose black when you're done you click on save over here in the top right hand corner and then back then you're going to click on the f plus again okay and you're going to choose a relative strength index which is your rsi we're going to have period one 
apply to clothes any color of your choice over there and then these are the levels we're gonna have level 90 10 80 and 20 so basically 90 80 10 and 20 your 80 level is your sell zone and your 20 level is your buy zone we have black color and one pixel click back and then click save top right corner then what you're going to do is you're going to click on the f plus by indicator window one you're going to go ahead and click on bollinger band again the settings are the same so all you do is you just go ahead and click on save because the settings are the same as in the main chart over here the main chart bollinger band and indicator window one the settings are the same so those are the settings for the indicator for the strategy the indicators that you need for the strategy remember it's the second zoom level remember to wait for those zones your sell zone on boom pairs and your buy zone on crash pairs i hope that you guys enjoyed this strategy like i always say practice on your demo account if you don't have a demo account click the link in the description below and sign up for your demo account practice the strategy apply risk management please leave a like on the video subscribe and share this video as much as possible turn on your notification bell so you can get notified when i do drop the next video and i will see you guys on the next one